And final stop of the night comes on the ice after a rocky February to say the least. The Fort Wayne Comets have started to find a little bit of new life as the new month opens up. Entry night, the K's had won three of their last four and look to cap off a possible four point weekend hosting Indy. Indy, let's get you over to the Coliseum. Ryan Fanti in the net for the black and orange tonight against the fuel and his offense gave him plenty of help early. First period power play for the K's. That's toward Linden redirects the Xavier Bernard shot home. That's one nothing Fort Wayne. Just under a minute later, the home team strikes again. Jack Dugan finds Xavier Comier lights the lamp his 10th and it is two nothing K's. Now Indy would claw their way back in this one though. 2-1 in the third when Seamus Malone finds the back of the net just 51 seconds into the period to tie up the game. But Fort Wayne showing some resilience later in the period. They get a five on three power play and it's Cormier again squeezing this shot home near the post. His second of the night, 11th of the year. Fort Wayne goes in front and that is where they stay. Kays win three to two to close out the weekend. No easy game in this league, and you know I'm, I'm proud of the way they battled. Um, you know, ideally we don't squander a two-goal lead, but you know we show resiliency. And you know, one thing I'll say about our group is, you know, all year when times are good or times are bad, we've never quit. You know, we've we've competed till the end. You know, whether it was good or bad, so proud of the way they handled themselves. Kays are off till next weekend when they'll welcome Wheel into town for two games Friday and Saturday, and then host Indy again on Sunday.